Hi, I'm Felix, lead designer at Golden Tricycle. And today we're going to show you our action-loaded puzzle game Clark that we're currently developing for the Ouya. Clark is an oily, heavy-duty working machine, a three-meter-tall, kind of robotic, diesel-punk forklift. But he's also very cute and clumsy, some kind of a nerdy janitor who just loves order and boxes. And he works on nuclear missile factory on Mars. Two years ago, Matthias and I had to quit our jobs as architects to make this game, so we started developing Clark in my living room. In the beginning of the game, Clark awakes and finds every other robot out of control, just partying, drinking toxic waste. On a search for answers, Clark meets the attractive nuclear rocket Clara and instantly falls in love. But their first date is brutally interrupted by the arrival of a hostile spaceship threatening to disarm the factory. All hell breaks loose. Evil robots kill everyone and kidnap Clara. Clark is the only one who is able to escape the factory. On the surface, he has to find a way to save his friends, rescue Clara and defeat the intruders. The only thing that you can really do in Clark is moving around boxes. There are lots of different box flavors. Some explode on impact or block beams, others bend beams, split beams, and mid beams. There's even one that you can charge and use as a gun. Which is good because you'll have to fight off nasty killer bots to protect your co-workers which are slightly dumb and a bit societal. Clark's world is about energy. All game elements are connecting power circuits that you need to repair. As we love board games and design our own prototypes, Clark's grid-based factory world is heavily influenced by the board game Robo Rally. To create our vast level spaces we sketch up tons of puzzles and discuss and redesign them. Picking just the best before we prototype them in Unity. There we assemble them to vast spaces using a catalogue of modular assets. It's a bit like Lego. Finally, we create thematic moods by lighting the levels with Unity's Beast Engine. Your journey will lead you through the factory, the sewers and even the trashy surface of Mars. Before you will enter the Lion's Lair, the heart of the mothership. We were raised with the Game Boy and we still love old school gaming. That's why Clark has these tight retro controls and a grid-based world. Our game is best experienced with the only true input device the controller. We love to see Clark on the TV. The graphics just look gorgeous on the big screen. The cool thing about indies is that they really innovate on gameplay. Until now, indie games were still missing a designated hardware platform, an indie console. And that is the Ouya. The Ouya gives indies a home, and we are excited to be part of this adventure. Mm -hmm.